you're a young professional looking to move to a cool new neighborhood in Austin. So where should you go and what are you going to get? So in this video, we're going to show you what you get for the money in the best neighborhoods for young professionals in Austin. So stay tuned. We're here in East Austin, and this is a 1900 square foot, four bedroom, four bath. It's about 975. So this is a pretty typical house in East Austin. You know, East Austin is known for its nightlife, for its restaurants, and there's a lot of new construction. Usually you're gonna get a smaller house like this that's on a smaller lot, but you're super convenient to everything that East Austin has to offer. So here's another great example of what you can get in East Austin for about a million dollars. So this one is a single family home, unlike the last one, which was an AB unit. And this one's on a longer, skinnier lot. It's got the hardwood floors that continue all the way upstairs into the primary bedroom, which is in the back of the house, which is nice, gives you a little more privacy and keeps it quiet. You got a large bathroom, you got a soaking tub, then you got a couple extra bedrooms that are perfect for home office or whatever else you need. Our next neighborhood for young professionals, we are now in the Mueller neighborhood. So this is a bit different from East Austin. It's still very walkable. There's lots of restaurants, there's lots to do, but it's definitely a lot quieter neighborhood. And it's got a much more of a community feel. You've got a great farmer's market, lots of activities, lots to do in this area. So let's go check out and see what you can get for around that million dollar mark in the Mueller neighborhood. This is our first example of what you get for about a million dollars. We are about one block from the heart of the Mueller neighborhood, and this house is 2,250 square feet, sits on a quarter acre of a lot, and really gives you a great comparison of what you get in Mueller versus in East Austin. And since we are a little bit further outside of East Austin and just outside of Mueller, you are getting a bit more house. You can see that you've still got the beautiful hardwood floors, well-updated home, beautiful primary bedroom and the primary bathroom is absolutely spectacular with the soaking tub the walk-in shower but you're just getting a little bit more space being a little bit further from the city so this house is right in the heart of Mueller. So if you want that true walkable vibe, this is gonna be a great option. This is about $900,000. It is a townhouse, 2,150 square feet. And you are right in the heart of everything that Mueller has to offer. You're walking to shops, the farmer's market, restaurants, everything else that you want. If you want that young professional lifestyle in the Mueller neighborhood, then this house is gonna have it for you. So this house might not be quite as modern as the other ones, but it's got a great layout. It's very comfortable, centrally located. You've got a couple of bedrooms upstairs. You've got a bedroom downstairs. You've got an office space downstairs. And you have a really nice private primary suite that's got its own bathroom, extra large closet, and really just kind of some nice touches for being right in such a mo very, very walkable area. All right, we've been to East Austin, we've been to Mueller, and I wanted to give you just a quick bonus option here. So we are about three blocks south of Mueller and we're about a mile north of East Austin. And this neighborhood is great because it gives you a little bit of a mix of the Mueller lifestyle, the East Austin lifestyle, but it has price points that are a little more entry level. So let's go take a look and see what you can get. So here we are, we're about 1,500 square feet, two bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms, and we're in the 600,000s, unlike those million dollar properties we were looking, in, looking at earlier. So what I love about this option is kind of an entry level price point is you've got a great location, but you're not really given anything up in terms of the features and the design of this property. So we've got upgraded quartz countertops. We've got some really custom, cool custom backsplash. I like the black appliance package, and we still even have two-toned cabinets. We've got the white cabinets, we've got the dark island, we've got the waterfall countertops. You've got a combined living room, dining room space, and what I love is out the window, you've got green, you've got your own private yard, you've got a 250-year-old oak tree sitting out there, and it really just gives you a quiet neighborhood feel, but we're under $700,000, just a couple blocks from Mueller, and this is a really great option if you're looking to get into this neighborhood. So upstairs we have two large bedrooms and then we got this great bonus space. This could be set up as a gym. It's also got wall mounts on the walls if you wanted to set it up as a, as a TV space. You got a big primary bedroom, lots of light. It's got a ceiling fan, an extra large walk-in closet, a really nicely done bathroom with a couple different upgrades that this owner did. So that was our bonus house between East Austin and Mueller. And now we're gonna go off to our next neighborhood, which is South Congress and Travis Heights. 
So here's another house in Travis Heights, South Congress. It's about a million dollars, a little different from some of the other stuff that we've seen, a much more traditional craftsman, about 2,100 square feet. And this one's got a lot of that really old craftsman detail. You've got this curved hallway. You've got the beautiful original wood floors that have been well restored and well taken care of. Big windows, tall ceilings, a fireplace, which is really not very common in Austin, and just a really charming feel in a great neighborhood that's usually full of more modern new construction. So if you're looking for something a little bit different, this is a great example of what you can get in South Congress and Travis Heights. And of course, a yard like this is definitely not very common and comes with some of these charming old houses. All right, so this is an example of what you get in Travis Heights for around a million dollars. This is 2,065 square feet. It's a 2019 build, so it's got a really modern design. It's got cool fixtures. It's got a stone countertop. It's got that really cool tile on the back of the island. It really just gives it a different vibe than a lot of other properties. But this one is also one of the skinnier units, so you do have quite a few stairs. When we get up onto the next floor, those hardwood floors carry throughout the entire house and you've actually got a little bit of a view from your primary suite and a lot of light because you're sitting up pretty high. I really like how they did this bathroom with the white tile, the dual sinks, the really big window, and you're kind of looking over top of your neighbors because you're sitting up high. You've also got some office space with big windows and a couple more bedrooms on the top floor of the unit. All right, so that wraps up our tour of three of the best neighborhoods for young professionals here in Austin and what you get around that million dollar price point with a couple different options in each neighborhood. I'm Matt Van Winkle. I run the Leverage here, team here in Austin. We want to be your resource for all things Austin and all things real estate. So if we can help you with either one of those two things, send me an email at info at austin.realestate and we'll see you next time. So let me know what you like about this house or which one was your favorite, which one was your least favorite. Let us know in the comments below.